here I am in the by now empty room in which we had our meeting this week of my colleagues from all over Africa where we have been discussing how we are doing our projects to promote freedom in Africa. Uh, people from the whole region, yeah, so, so inputs from Tanzania and Zimbabwe and Senegal and Ivory Coast and South Africa and so on. It was a fascinating meeting also with our colleagues uh, from Germany. We visited Johannesburg, we saw some very interesting developments, city planning developments in Johannesburg. And then in the end, we of course had a look at what whiskey goes best with these experiences. to have a look at uh, which whiskies we think fit, be fit best with this uh, stay in Johannesburg. We're trying three. We're trying one from the Isle of Jura, Prophecy, which uh, I expect will be a little bit on the smoky side. We're going to try a lowland whisky called Augentoschen, uh, Augentoschen Springwood, which should be a, a lighter whisky. And then uh, finally, a very northern whisky. Uh, old Pulteney uh, from uh, more or less the spot wick where you take uh, the boat to Orkney and I'm doing that with five of my friends and colleagues uh, there's Wayne from South Africa there's uh, Joe from Germany and then there's Mitoba from South Africa and there will be Manfred from Germany and then my colleague friend Inge from Germany. Let's see what they have to say about these whiskies. And what stands out for me is the amount of history that we've been through the past couple of days and the connection to Johannesburg. And of the whiskies available, the Jura reminds me most of the journey we took yesterday in, in Joburg. Um, there's a complexity, um, there's a, a roughness about the whiskey. Um, there's a warm area. I tend to go for the old Putney as a sort of harmonic medium whiskey, which, which uh, well, in, in the context of our meeting, fits in, uh, into everything and has a, uh, a very uh, nice taste. It's not, it's not too strong, it's not too superficial. Can I start with the selfie? <laughs> <laughs> I but the last one that we tasted today. Um, old uh, Paul Tenney, 
um, that was uh, the one that stuck with me the most because uh, of the way that it tasted. It, it tasted a little bit burnt at a distance, which then reminded me of uh, my father's cold session. It uh, was you know, telling the story of South Africa, which is burnt at a distance. So um, it, 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 it kind of stuck like that to me, and it's the one that I'll remember the most. My personal favorite was this one. I think it was a balanced one with a still yet distinct aroma and very complex. And that mirrors the atmosphere that we had and the results of this conference. So it was very fruitful, not only because of our whiskey tasting at the end, but the conference itself was comparable to what I experienced here. On my glass it says, Drum mit Martin. And that has something to say, as it says on our coasters, drink, think, relax. That's what we all should do. I discovered whiskey here in South Africa and a lot of my friends here, they really liked whiskey and before for me I'd rather tend it rather to wine and, 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 and champagne and things and actually the, the times I remember that I drank whiskey were in places uh, which we also visited at this uh, regional meeting or similar places like the Thunder Walker. I actually had a lot of whiskey in places here in downtown Joburg. Whiskey is such a complex uh, drink and in, in the end it, it, it gives um, it there's a harmony in, 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 in drinking it, but you can still smell and, and, and sense the different ingredients. And, and, we're, and we're looking at the people who were here at the, at the regional meeting. That's actually it, and this is what I appreciate so very much about this region. And, and um, I, I must say, for, for me, I, I actually liked the first one, which was perhaps more the ladies' version, the lighter one. It's something I always like, like the smooth um, taste of it, uh, but I understand what you're saying when it's going more profoundly. But if I had like a longer night in one of these nice clubs in, 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 in Joburg downtown, I would rather go to that.